Ever wondered how a hysterectomy is actually performed? Let's break it down, quick and simple. A hysterectomy is a surgical procedure to remove a woman's uterus. It's usually done to treat issues like fibroids, endometriosis, chronic pain, or even cancer. There are three main ways to do it. First, an abdominal hysterectomy, where doctors make a cut in the belly. Second, a vaginal hysterectomy, where the uterus is removed through the vagina. And third, a laparoscopic hysterectomy, using tiny tools and a camera through small incisions. Once the patient is under anesthesia, the surgeon detaches the uterus from nearby tissues. This might include the cervix, ovaries, or fallopian tubes, depending on the case. After carefully removing the uterus, they close up the area using stitches or surgical glue. Recovery time depends on the type of surgery. Some bounce back in a few weeks, while others need a bit longer. There's soreness, but most women heal well with time. Now you know exactly how a hysterectomy is done. Share this with someone curious about women's health and follow for more quick medical breakdowns.